That's yeah. the question. No, that I was you just going to say, um, Fawad Khan and you. I mean, yeah, right? Exactly. I knew we had to ask this. <laughs> I mean, right from the days of Hamza Farmahira, obviously, like, we see on screen pairings that have been successful, other on screen pairings, and you want to see them again, but. This was just explosive, and it did not die down. You know, people wanted to see you both together again. And I thought about this when I watched Ham Safar and when I rewatched it, and then, you know, in retrospect later again. But Khirad and Usher's roles in Ham Safar, the, the roles that you and Fawad did, for people who might not know, when, when you watch them, you know, again and again, you realize that. It was, it was very interesting because whilst there were moments when things were said, there were moments when people were screaming, but there were also a lot of silences. And there were a lot of moments, I think, where less was more. And that sort of, at least for me personally as an audience, I felt there was a lot of innuendo and that added a kind of mystery and a kind of, you wanted more, you know, you kind of, and at that point, I think it was, it was so powerful because the audience's imagination came into play, right? And you felt like, talk to us. I'm, not, I'm less interested in what the relationship with Fawad is like, but what really do you think makes this relationship tick in such an extraordinary way? Is it the nature of the roles you've done? And how do you preserve something so special? <laughs> You preserve it by not working with each other yeah. for a very yeah. long time. <laughs> yeah. um, it's, it's funny that people think that me and Fawad have actually done a lot of work together. We haven't. We've just done Hamsafar and now Mola Jet. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so I think, yeah, I think somewhere we have gotten lucky with, like you said, preserving that whatever you all want to call it spark or magic or the chemistry i think <laughs> i don't know i don't know what it is i just hope that um, i just hope that we are never aware of what it is mm. because i think the minute we are aware of oh what is it that makes us together come together and become this what you guys love so much um, I think the, time, the day we get a, become aware of it, we might lose it. So we don't even, th I don't think he thinks about it too much. Yeah. And I don't think about it. Um, I do think, you know, my, my friend said to me, he's, she's like, we were talking about Nilofer. That's our next project that's coming out. And she's like, um, oh, so um, she's like, oh, Nilofer is also happening. You know, it's going to come out next. I was like, yeah. She's like, and that's with Fawad. I said, yeah, that's with Fawad. She's like, I say, I have to tell you, your best work is with him and his best work is with you. I was like, whoa, <laughs> geez, thanks. That means it's only like three or two things. Um, yes. But I think it's just like you said, it's, there is something that people love about us together. Mm -hmm. And honestly, there is no other way for me to look at it except for be grateful for it and to take care of it, you know, to not misuse it so much. I think we both have been very mindful of that. Yeah. Let's do this, this. Yeah. No, we don't do that. Uh, we're very, yeah, we're very like, okay, this, this is maybe for us, you yeah. know? So Mola and Mukho, I think, were meant for us. Mm. And uh, Nilofar for sure is something special. So uh, you guys will get to see a full-blown romance. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah.